Okay, Wolfpack Thursday, we've got uh, our bodybuilding, a little push-pull work, switch things up a little bit on the second part B if you're looking to get a little bit of extra uh, strength training. Um, and I have progressed both of these rep counts um, on both A and B. So last week was five, four, three, two, one, so 15 total reps. Um, and I cut the sets down to two to three. Uh, I think just three to four last week was just way too aggressive and it just took way too much time to get through um, one full set. So we got six, five, four, three this week. So we've got 18 reps compared to the 15 and 12, 10, eight, six. So we've got 20, 36. So actually six additional, additional reps here. So, um, goal would be to match the same weights we did for the bench press, uh, the same weights we did for the bent over barbell row. Um, obviously last week with the first time doing it, we may have, um, estimated a little bit lower or uh, use a little bit lighter weight just to make sure we get through with it. So if you want to match the weight because we're increasing the volume, that'd be a great progression. Um, otherwise, if it was too light last week, feel free to add a little bit of weight um, for these sets today. So just make sure again that they're unbroken, not the most challenging sets in the world because I think the 654 is going to be a little bit more challenging than the um, 543. So the reps going down 543 is, I feel like is pretty doable, but Six is big, five is big, and then the last set of four I think is going to be challenging too. So, um, again, rest as long as you need between uh, the six, twelve, five, ten, four, eight, three, six. But we want to move through it somewhat rapidly so we can get through, keep the pump, and not uh, have each set take a ton of time. Okay, so move with intent, but rest long enough to where you can still um, maintain unbroken sets and um, and it feel good. Okay. If you're doing the extra strength work, same rep scheme of alternating dumbbell bench. So it's going to be six on each. So you hold both up into a full extended position and you'll go one, one, two, two. So you'll alternate reps. Um, so it'd be 12 total reps, but six on each. And then we got beautiful barbell curls. I know everybody's going to be super excited about that. Um, just 12 to 86 to match the bent over row. Obviously lighter than the bent over row weight, but again, unbroken here. Um, if you're going to do the Metcon portion, it is the same setup as last week. We just kind of flip-flopped um, the calories and the burpees. So it's still going to be um, both partners working at the same time for the first two. And then when you get to the burpees at the end, uh, it's going to be alternating. So basically, again, one partner runs. The other partner starts on the machine. First round is rower. Second round is ski. You're going to do as many calories on the rower as you can until your partner comes back from the run flip-flop so the rower will go out and run runner will start rowing and then when that second runner comes back in with the remaining time we're going to do max bar facing burpees um and you're just going to alternate one working one resting here so again time frame we're looking at you know a couple minutes on the run two and a half minutes on the run five minutes or so combined uh you should have around four minutes on the bar facing burpees each set i think that would be uh perfect any faster than that um if you guys decide you want to run faster it's gonna um, obviously be more fatiguing but it's also going to take away time from the rowing and the ski erg so you won't get as many calories there so you kind of have a couple options either you run fast uh, sacrifice a little bit of the calories on the ergs but get to the burpee sooner so that you can uh, one work one rest and maybe rip out more burpees or vice versa take a little bit longer on the run cruise right so we don't have as much fatigue but then your partner's going to be on the machine for a little bit longer um, so it could work out either way. So I don't know if you guys want to play to each other's strengths or you kind of have a choice there of how you want to attack it. But um, rest two minutes. Uh, last week was actually supposed to be two minutes, but I failed to update um, the workout. So you get a two-minute rest, and then we'll go back through the same thing, and then we'll do skiered on the second round. So with this two-minute rest, just make sure we're pushing the paces on the machines when we're there. We're pushing the pace at the end on the burpees because you do get that additional minute of rest, so we should recover a little bit. But other than that, Great day to get better. We get a nice pump. See you uh, guys all in your uh, bro tanks and your and your sleeveless shirts, so we can see those guns. Have a great Thursday, and we'll see you in class later.